So we're going to go there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now we're at the main entrance of the Welcome Center to Mount Vernon. This way. And this is where we get tickets. This is the upper garden of the mansion. Not sure what this building over here to the left is. This was the greenhouse. That's what it was. Oh, look at that cardinal. You see the gar cardinal? Where? There. Oh my gosh. He's been dancing from one side of the shrub to this other side of the shrub. So this is the gardener's house, and it appears to look like uh, brick, like big rock, but it's not. It's actually wood carved to look like that, which is interesting, and that's the house. The first house there is the clerk's quarters. The second building is the smokehouse. So they did all the washing and the ironing in here. This is the coach house. So that's where they put the horse and buggies. This is where they kept the horses. You can still smell the horse smell. So this is the stables. Wow. They keep eight horses in here. Just breathtaking. What is this? This is where they put all the poop at that they'd use organically to make cobblestone. Interesting. Let's go down here. This is the ice house. This is the view of the Washington House. And this fence is called the Ha Ha Fence, and there's a reason for that. The reason is he didn't want a fence to obstruct the mansion view for visitors that came because they entertained a lot here. They had 637 visitors, and he didn't want a fence to obstruct the view, so he built this brick fence called the Ha Ha Fence to keep the animals farm animals away and it worked so here's the fence coming up the little hill it's a tall fence but um from the bottom it just looks like it's level to the ground but it's not and so that's what kept all the animals farm animals off the grounds to the house that tree is absolutely beautiful golly this is beautiful George and Martha Washington, along with 20 other family members, were originally interred in the old vault. In accordance with his will, Washington directed the building of the new tomb, and the Washingtons were moved into the new tomb in 1831. So they moved their bodies and took them to the new tomb. Let's go check that out. So now we're approaching Washington's tomb. Look at this tree. That tree's been here since 1899. George Washington's tomb was erected in 1831, so 25 family members are buried here. 
So 317 enslaved men and women and children had no choice but to live here. And in his will, Washington provided for freedom of 123 individuals he owned. Effective upon Miss Washington's death, he, she also freed them early January 1, 1801, and the remaining 194 people remained enslaved after the deaths of General and Miss Washington. Now we're approaching the slave memorial. What's this say over here? It just gives me chills. In memory, in memory of the many servants, colored servants of Washington, buried at Mount Vernon from 1760 to 1860, the unidentified ground grave surrounded this spot, 1929. So many unmarked graves. I don't know if you can see them, but there's all these little rocks everywhere surrounding these trees and all over those trees as well. You can see them right here. There's like eight or nine, 10, 11, 12. Look at all that corn. Looks like some sort of stable. Keep hay, wagons and buggies, tools. Let's see what this says over here. Yeah, it's where they kept their farm equipment. Lost my husband somewhere. An innovative barn. It's beautiful inside. That's what it looks like from this end. It's absolutely amazing. Sunrise to sunset. Let's see what this is about. This was a slave cabin quarters. And a little fireplace and a bed and stairs that went up to the loft. We were told the beds in the White House are made out of horse hair and down feathers. This is called a forest? Forest trail. Forest trail. That's a long way up there, dear. After all the walking we've done. This has been an amazing tour though. Definitely worth the money. We'll talk about all the trees. As you go up this trail. We're at the top now. Of the forest. And they hear all the sounds. Beautiful.